Need pasta, parmesan, or pizza, and the Italians have you covered. Ask them to build you a tank, and well, the results are usually mixed. Unless you look back at World War II, that is, when Italian armor was flat out dismal. Italian tanks evolved little from the halcyon sardine tin dates of the interwar era. The one man tankettes that saw service in the 1930s were little more than bare bones, lightly armored squirrel guns, but they were enough to handle Italy's colonial disputes. Fast forward a few years, and Italy found itself plunged into the deep end of the pool. It developed a series of medium tanks to supplement its tankette force, but these were plagued by mechanical issues and rapidly outclassed by Allied armor. Operational disasters in North Africa and Sicily revealed Italy's weakness. It lacked the industry to reform its armored force, was marred by corporatist corruption and inefficiency, and could never produce heavy enough engines to scale up their tank production. Italian tankers should perhaps have joined the infantry after all. What's your take on Italian tanks, yay or nay?